Hey girl, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Nay back with another video. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Nay. And for today's video, I'm going to be doing my skincare routine for my textured skin. So make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and also turn on your post notifications for my future upcoming videos. It's just a disclaimer. This is just what works for me. I am not a dermatologist or skincare specialist. So we're just going to go ahead and get into the video. First, I start off by opening my pores with a hot rag. I'm just going to all across my face. Next, I'm going with my Garnier Micellar Water. As you can see, I absolutely love this product. I used all of the product for my larger one, so I had to go get the one for my travel kit. I have the blue top. I prefer this one. I love it because it removes makeup. I don't know the difference between this one and the other one, but how I apply this is I just take a cotton ball and put the water onto the cotton ball and just go across my skin so I can remove any excess dirt from the surface of my skin before I go into my pores with my cleansers and my spin brush. I prefer this method over a makeup wipe as well because it's not so harsh on my skin. I do also have sensitive skin, but as you can see, I'm starting to get red spots to form, but those will be also gone by the end of the video. Next, I use my Plum Beauty Spin Brush and also my Hydro Boost Hydrating Cleansing Gel from Neutrogena. As for the gel, I love this product so much. It contains hyaluronic acid, which helps improve the texture of your skin and also evens out your skin tone. This cleanser boosts hydration for soft and supple skin, as it does say on the bottle. And personally, this is just great for my dry skin. I have in some areas of my face where I tend to flake. So I do this process for about five minutes. And just some details on the spin brush as for it, I absolutely love this product as well. Um, I bought it from Walmart for about 5 to $10. It is very effective and it digs into all of my pores and does the job just like any other spin brush would. And I'll be sure to go ahead and link all of these products I'm using in this video down below. So once again, I just go in with my hot rag and just wipe off all of the excess soap. And as you can see, I'm just wiping very thoroughly, just making sure there's no remaining product on my skin before I get into my next product. Next, I'm going to be going in with my second cleanser, which is my CeraVe Renewing SA Cleanser. And y'all, literally go grab this now. This is a game changer. So this cleanser contains salicylic acid. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right which exfoliates and softens textured skin. And also it has vitamin D, which is also great as well overall if you have textured skin. So guys, go buy this now. I absolutely love this product and seen changes within my first week of using it. So as for my toners, first I'll be using my Glycolic Acid Serum from Art Naturals. I got this from Target for about $12.99. So Glycolic Acid removes layers of dead skin. This also smoothens skin and gives you a more natural glowy look. It has so many benefits to Glyconic Acid that you can look up on your own if you're interested. And also being new to this product, it will cause a small irritation within the first couple of uses. Um, but it is very tolerable in you'll eventually get used to it. And once again, I am just thoroughly drying my face before I apply my next product. Okay, once I go ahead and let that dry up, next I go in with my lactic acid plus AHA from Art Naturals as well. 
This lactic acid is absolutely great for dry and sensitive skin. It also helps moisturize and improve my hydration on my skin. Once again, this product has also caused me a little irritation in the beginning of using it. But like I said, it's very tolerable. So I'm just going in and applying it to my skin. Alright, and once again, after I do finish applying, I am going to thoroughly dry my skin just so everything can be dry before I apply my moisturizer all right girl and as you can see all of the red marks that were below my nose are now gone and then the next thing I do is just I want to go grab my lip gloss to just apply it to my lips because they were completely dry so I do apologize about my dry lips y'all but yeah, I went ahead and did that just so I can moisturize my lips as well. I did have an exfoliator, but I did lose it, so. Alright, finally we have made it to the end. Thank you so much for watching this long, y'all. And lastly, the final product in my skincare routine is just my moisturizer. And what I use is my CeraVe SA Lotion for Rough and Bumpy Skin. As you can see, I broke the top, so this is how I apply it. And also, I let my skin completely dry before I apply this because the times that I have not, I have experienced um, mild irritation, which is not supposed to happen. So I wait until about 30 minutes after I apply my lactic acid. And as you can see, like, I'm excited, period. Like, yes, skin, yes. <laughs> but the moisturizer is absolutely amazing. It's, it contains ceramides, um, salic acid, and also vitamin Ds. Also, off exfoliates and soft and smooth to rough skin okay y'all and this is just the final look i'm giving you guys you can see how smooth my skin looks all right guys that is the end of my video thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy make sure you comment like and subscribe and make sure you turn on your post notifications to stay tuned